You know, I've talked a lot on this channel about loving each other and helping each other out, but one thing I don't know that I mentioned is uh, helping yourself out and loving yourself, which is probably the first step in all of that, and the most important step, too. Uh, I mean, how are you going to love anybody else if you don't love yourself? You can't show anybody any kind of love that you know if you don't know it yourself. I mean, another thing I've never talked about many moons ago was I had to deal with that, and I had to go through that uh, change of learning how to love myself because I didn't uh, for a long, long time. And... Uh, I, I mean, over a decade ago, I paddled myself out in the bush, packed up my canoe with no intention of turning or returning. And while out there, you're starting fires and catching food and doing my thing, I learned that I wasn't so bad, you know. I got comfortable in my own skin, and I, and I learned that I was fairly capable of looking after myself. And I learned to love myself out there. And I'm not saying that's the, the way that everybody needs to go, is go paddle out in the bush and come back a week later or change man. Uh, we have our own timeline and our own journeys. But the most important thing that I'm trying to say here is, you know, not everybody goes out there and has a great beginning and, and winds up loving himself right off the boot. Uh, sometimes, you know, you gotta you gotta learn that. You gotta you gotta teach yourself to love yourself because, uh, you know, everybody's beginning is different. So, just know that you're not so bad. You can do it. And you know what? If you need some guidance from the Bushmen, I'm here. <laughs>
Yeah. Here's our 10-10 winner. He won a couple of events there, and the biggest log, he cut that the fastest, and guess what? It was a P60. Yeah, it was. So there you have it. What an awesome day, and what a great group of people. Which brings me to the cast of kindness. I'm going to have to give it to the Canadian Vintage Chainsaw Hoarders group and everybody that came to the SARG review. I mean, you guys are just a wonderful, loving group of people, and I could have asked for nicer people to enjoy the day with. Um, I'm just going to close this, because this is getting rather warm on my shoulder. <laughs> Uh, and we'll leave you off here on this video because I do have a little bit of footage of the Bushmen goofing around here. Uh, thanks to Kane uh, Costoza for uh, taking that footage for me there. I just got me running a couple of saws there. But I did a darn good job running them. <laughs>